Okay, well, the Texas A&M University Board of Regents approved some major changes in their latest meeting. One of those being the creation of a new space institute and the construction of a $200 million facility next to the Johnson Space Center. Six News reporter Jordan Adams, he has more. On Wednesday, members of the Texas A&M Board of Regents approved the creation of the Texas A&M Space Institute and the construction of a $200 million facility in Houston. Now it's time, and now we're pressing beyond the Earth orbit. Now we're going back to the moon. We're going on to Mars. There's no doubt in my mind. Those missions are in place. The vehicles are in place. The people are trained to do that. So there's no more exciting time than now. According to the former astronaut, the future is bright for both TAMU and NASA. The Lone Star State is set to remain a leader in space exploration and is poised to become a space industry leader as well. Space is going to connect into almost every major economic sector. And so if you want to be a part of the future of your, your economic sector, you need to embrace how to exploit space and use it for your business. The facility is set to be built adjacent to the Johnson Space Center in southeast Houston, where scientists and other personnel will aid in mission training, advanced robotics, aeronautics research, and both lunar and Martian exploration. If we want to get expertise from mission operators, mission designers, engineers, astronauts, it's very easy for them to just hop over literally, you know, a couple of blocks and come work with our students and work with our faculty. Construction on the facility is expected to start at the end of the calendar year and should take about two years to complete. For Six News, I'm Jordan Adams.